What up, Lexor? I see you. Love for you. Hello. We're unbanned, folks. Lenar Tochua. Thank you. I appreciate you. I love you as well. We're unbanned on here, man. We got unbanned. Or unsuspended. Sorry, it wasn't even like a ban. Um, <clears throat> you bought INX because of me. No, you bought INX because of you. I just told you about it. But you, because many people don't make it past the SEC part of it where it's like complying with regulations. So you did it. Uh, can you talk more about INX? Yeah, we, we can talk about INX in here. Um, yeah. Uh, yo, Cherell85, I see you. Appreciate you for watching. Let's wait till some more people get in here. Hopefully they didn't put me on the naughty list because I got, I got, uh, suspended. Where can I buy INX? You cannot buy it. Man, I need to put that as like my Twitter, my pinned tweet. You cannot buy INX until July, sometime in July. And I will of course be updating you on how that's, how you can buy it and everything. Um, but if you were paying attention on my YouTube channel, you would have been in the IPO with us. We all got in the IPO. That's why YouTube is where it happens, folks. Let's try. Uh, okay, thoughts on XTZ? XTZ is kind of slept on. Okay, XTC is kind of slept on. I did used to own some of it. I currently don't own any of it. But I do own a bunch of NFTs that are on the Tezos blockchain. I do own a bunch of NFTs just for fun they're cheap they're not expensive nfts i've showed my collection before uh but i do own them on the tezos blockchain um yo crystal i see you showing love with the confetti thank you crystal um yeah we're back we're back i'm not ever pointing my camera in that direction again i swear it's staying right here i'm not getting suspended on here We're not showing no nothing. Okay, I'm being a good boy on here now because they're putting me on the naughty list for sure. Um, Nefi's a no go for me. I'm sorry. I don't. I don't really. Um, yeah. Uh, don't do that again. That was ridiculous. If you would have seen it, I uploaded the stream to my YouTube, my second channel, and you can just see it cut off because I got banned. <laughs> Uh, so stupid. I showed, um, Live Bounty, I showed myself burning some resins, some myrrh, frankincense, um, balsam of to tolu, and I just showed it, and it looked like, you know, bad drugs, and the AI thought it was some drugs. Uh, buy some ADA for your sake. <laughs> for my sake, let's see what it's at. 123. I'm not buying any Cardano above a dollar. I'm sorry. Like, you guys gotta remember that Cardano has already went from. Like, you could have got it at the start of this year for like 22 cents. 20 cents. I did have some. I did have some at 30 cents. Um, yeah. We're gonna talk about INX. Man, these sound. I need to get get on my SoundCloud Premium. What's six? Wait, what? What is sixty nine thousand four hundred twenty Elon Musk posts every year? What? Uh, are you buying crypto at the moment? No, I'm not buying anything right now. Um, it's so hard for me to be. A crypto person because I'm so comfortable in my portfolio 
You got Cardano, 33 cents. It was worth it then, but definitely not now. Yeah, Cardano's the one I burned myself with because I sold. I bought at 33. Let's see how much I lost. We can see my... Here, I'll pull up my Exodus wallet. I've lost thousands. I could have made like... If I just held, I would have made 17,000 bucks on Cardano. If I just held. That's why. Usually if you do nothing. Usually if you do nothing, you make money, folks. In this this business. You just gotta make sure... Like The key is to not like be over-invested. Now, I'm obviously over-invested, but I don't need the money that I have in crypto. So it's like... I'm not using this to like pay my bills and stuff. <clears throat> Crypto Mason is Kuabara from Yu Yu Hash. What? What is that? I want to see that. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Kua. Kuabara. Kuabara. From what? Yu Yu. Okay, I'm gonna look at that in a second. Um. Hoddle gang. Yep. Are we going down more in ETH? I have no idea. I have not even... I looked at the charts once in the morning and that's it. But 1,700? Like, damn. 1,700? I just realized, like, last summer you could have got ETH for $200. You said INX full name. It's not a crypto. You can't even buy it right now. See, this is why I love those posts. Hold on. Everyone who mentions this biggest thing is getting muted, by the way. Uh, Jungly, what up? Why do you hodl altcoins? Altcoins are for trading. Man, who screwed you up, bro? In the head. You need to know what you hold on some of these. All the ones that... Like, there are altcoins that are shitcoins. There are, there are altcoins that are shitcoins. Most of those reside on the second page, okay? On the second page, or actually, like most of them. Not not all of them, of course. But, like, to call them all shitcoins is just stupid. Like, that's very stupid. Um, I hodl altcoins that will make it, you know, years. Uh, we got another mute here. I wish I had some mods. Crystal, are you still in here? I'm going to mod you. Why would any... Oh, okay, so the FUD is prevalent, folks. There is, like, extreme FUD right now around XRP. Extreme FUD. Yo, JPM coin will never be released to the public. I'm still doing research on this because I just... Basically, I heard about it way before, but now it's coming back up and I need to know everything about it. Um, yeah, it don't, it won't be an investable thing, I don't think. Won't be an investable thing. If it is, I'm probably gonna buy some. But there's huge fun. Huge fun around XRP right now. And well, especially on TikTok, and I feel like it's transferring to Twitter. Um, what just happened to XRP? What do you mean? Um Yeah, so the JPM coin is for their clients. That's it. Like, okay, but then the argument would be that all the banks are going to make their own thing. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, let me check the cool bar thing. This guy? I'm this guy? Dude, how? I don't even look like him. Oh, my hair kind of, I can see it. So basically, this is how the argument goes. This is how the argument goes. XRP won't be used by banks. Um, they're going to make their own private thing. JPM coin. Okay, that's how they say it. Okay, then you say, okay, yep. They can make their own private thing, but all of them are going to make their own private thing? Or all of them are going to use JPM coin? So one bank rules them all? Like, what is... To compare JPM coin to... XRP is absolutely stupid. It's, it's literally dumb. Now, the concept of banks making their other making their own things is not dumb. That's not dumb at all. The concept of banks making their own. Okay, then 
I always come back to this. Why did 100 plus banks already sign up and why are they still signing up during a lawsuit for Ripple? So I have these doubts too, folks. I have these doubts too. Early crypto winter, I feel like we're going to have a slow summer. I said that two weeks ago. We're going to have a slow summer. Like through these months. And I think, honestly, BitBoy's prediction of it being over in September 28 might not be accurate. I don't know. The world is larger than JP. Yeah, see, X... The, the X at the front of XRP means it doesn't belong to a country. Hold on, let me send a thing out on my telegram. Um, that means it's... That means it's not from a country. Oh, we got another mute. Boom. Every time I write, he looks away. <laughs> the one time you write that, though, I looked at it. BitBoy is too blinded by BTC maximalism? No, he's not. No, he's not at all. X, uh, Bit, BitBoy loves XRP. He likes it. Or I shouldn't say he likes it. He, he inv He's invested in it. Um... Why do you love XRP so much? It's cool and all, but why do you fall in love with your trades? Dude, you got me all screwed up, bro. I don't trade, first of all. I'm not in love with XRP. I could, couldn't care less if it goes to 10 cents, 5 cents. It is just, I have a passion for changing um, the financial system. It's too slow. It's outdated, it's slow, it's BS. It's complete BS. It's outdated, slow, blah, blah, blah. I, why can't I send an instant transfer, cross-border, instantly, like I can send an email, folks? Now, Stellar XLM, I saw an interview with the founder or something. It was a female. She was the... Is she the co-founder or is she the... Co-founder Stellar XLM. I think she is. Or the founder. Or the CEO, maybe. Somebody from Stellar said that we should be able to send money like emails to anywhere in the world. Like in Canada, we have e-transfer. But why can't I, can't I send money frictionless, low cost, and instantly? Like an email. With an email, I can send an email to somebody in China like that. Should be the same with money, okay? Um, yes, XLM has the same creator from XRP, Jed McCaleb, who is currently dumping XRP on the market because he's in a contract. Cole, you're messed up, bro. Don't get me booted off here, man. Talk VeChain ain't nothing to say about VeChain except that I gave my dad some for his birthday. Uh, what is a cruise? Banks want to make more money with transactions. See, but if they saved money, it would be essentially them making money too. If they can save money by using... Actually, what XRP does is it can free up capital too. So basically right now... Like, banks have to have a leg in every country. They have to have a leg in every country. And you could just hold XRP and free up all of that capital. Blockchain Boy is still laughing that XRP is centralized. Why? Okay, so the supply of XRP is centralized. Basically. They have 50 billion. Or something. Like that. So, that's what you could say. But okay, the hash rate of Bitcoin is centralized. Cent uh, decentralization has layers, folks. It has layers. It has layers of like, or different aspects of it.
but XRP Ledger is completely decentralized. Telcoin. There's like moderate versions of these coins. Like Cello. Cello is the moderate version of Quant. And I feel like... Hold on, what was it? I already forgot. I feel like... Um, okay, Conscious Kate Border, you're, you're messed up. Oh, I feel like Telcoin is the... The... Um, watered down version of xrp because there's the partnerships with xrp are unbeatable like look who they have <laughs> look who they have it's just unbeatable it's just unbeatable is this you crypto mason no no you see there's a w in the name this is my only account on tiktok right here Litecoin is a no-go, man. If you want to make money, though, maybe. But as a long-term, no. Can XRP exist without Ripple? Yes, of course. They are completely detached. Which I feel like they weren't at one time. Um, ICP was not a rug pull. It was just the Definity Foundation doing some weird stuff. Are you single? Yes. Can USD solve? Um, USDT, no. Price prediction, quant, end of this year. Don't have any anymore, dude. It shattered mine. Shattered mine. All I wanted was 100 bucks, And it did that, so now I know it can do that. Did I see Jay-Z's CryptoPunk? Yeah, dude. Jay-Z changed his profile picture to CryptoPunk. To a CryptoPunk. Look at Jay-Z's CryptoPunk, folks. That's Jay-Z's crypto punk right there. What happened with Pundi X? Ooh. Pundi X was absolutely uh it was killed. All of the hype was drained from that. Basically. Your thoughts on blockchain boy constantly finding a reason to hate XRP? I don't know. There's something he just can't accept. Um, there's something he can't accept or it's like a lack of research a lot of people just don't want to research XRP like I have one video I keep directing people to it it's not my video it's one video that you can watch and you'll understand exactly what they're trying to do with this Bobcat Miner yeah Helium Miners are good be careful there's a bunch of influencers making thousands off of you buying helium miners. <laughs> it's crazy. So make sure you just buy your own. Or if you want to support them, then you can buy it from them. But they take a long time. I've I've I bought my helium miner like three months ago. Still has not came. Still I don't even have a shipping notification or anything. Okay. So it takes a long, long time. Takes a long, long time. Jay-Z is moving NFTs. Yo, did you change your name to Crypto Mob? You did. Uh, I bought a helium miner last week, got it in two days. Watch Digital Perspectives video on YouTube. Yeah, Digital Perspectives is good. He's definitely good. Um, 
those are the dudes who'll never never see the other side though really they'll never see the other side but it's cool just make sure you're you're also not in an echo chamber uh crypto mailman thanks for the uh Who's things your favorite artist? This dude says you oh you're you might get muted for that. You promoted ICP and it's a scam, bro. What the hell are you talking about, dude? Oh, I'm I'm next time you say something like that, I'm muting you, bro. I don't even care. I don't even care. I don't promote coins, first of all. I've promoted some. Paid promo on some, but ICP, I've never told anybody to buy ICP in my life. Don't buy that shit. It's trash. But you want my real opinion on ICP? It's trash. It's a head fake. It's a distraction from what's real. Um, so don't buy that shit. The way they came out. Crazy marketing move to get a little cult following. The founders have now dumped whatever, 20 million coins. They started the supply, whatever, uh, centralized, right? Yeah. If I do a paid promo, I tell you it's a paid promo. Posting a video about a coin that's doing malicious things with the supply um, is not promo. Well, it, everything is promo if you just talk about it, but... Um... Obviously, the ICP project is good, okay? Obviously. It has insane backers. Insane backers, but... Just, like, why? It's never... Like, why would you just come out fourth on the market cap and then gain a little cult following who thinks you're the next Bitcoin or something because the market cap is so high? Um, are you Canadian? Yep. I am Canadian. INX. Man, INX. Honestly, I was waiting to post. I was waiting to post like hardcore about it. But people started posting. So I'm like, dude, I've been on this for months. I better make a post. So I did, and anyone who was paying attention on my YouTube channel, you got into the IPO for 90 cents. Um, Dragomir Proichev, I pronounced it. Any word on Flare Network? Oh my, is it messy? It's messy, messy. But I feel I they killed off their little, um, you know, their distribution thing. They killed off their little distribution thing. Or the governance. The vote thing for governance. But now they're just going to to the original thing. The original thing. So I'm just waiting. I still hold some of my IOUs. I didn't get the airdrop. I hope they don't screw me over and say that I did the airdrop. Uh, but you got to make sure you know the tax implications of that have you heard of daisy no i haven't heard of that um how much time per day do you invest in research depends what i'm doing today i'm not doing nothing so i'm gonna be watching videos making tiktok videos making youtube videos um watching this the crypto news that's coming out watching crypto twitter you just make this a lifestyle and I'm never not paying attention, folks. I'm never not paying attention to this again. That is the way you get wrecked. You could have bought Ethereum for 200 bucks last summer if you were paying attention. I was not paying attention last summer at all. Um, Quant versus Ethereum. Hey, real talk, you turned me on to Crypto Panic. 
I swear, I was one of the early ones on Crypto Panic. Best, best uh, possible app, dude. Best possible app. Um, because it's a news aggregator and you can just see a bird's eye view of everything. Ethereum next two days price. I couldn't care less, man. I don't know. Are we in a bear market? <laughs> that question is so dumb, man. It's such a dumb question. It's such a dumb question. You're trying to label the present moment something that you would have to, like when you look at a bear market, you look back on it. Um, I've heard crab market thrown around. That's a new term for me. Um, and I heard we're coming out of it, but dude, I don't care. You guys got to realize what position I'm in. I'm a long-term investor. I pick the coins that are going to change the financial system and I stack them. So if we do go to a bear market... I do not care at all. Uh, Brian made a shit vid on XRP today. Yep, the FUD is strong. The FUD is strong. Big, big FUD. Mason, can you explain why you're not holding majority Bitcoin? Well, because my risk, my risk desire is higher. So all the money I would put in Bitcoin goes into QNT. Because QNT has a lower supply than Bitcoin, and I believe in QNT for the long term. And it's going to give me more returns because the market cap can move substantially. Um, like the upside is bigger on the market cap. If Bitcoin goes to 100,000, uh, if Bitcoin goes to 100,000, I make three times my money. I am not trying to just three times my money. That is super good. That's super duper good. Especially because that could happen in one year. But I am trying to really do something with my money. Um, and I do think like I'm so convinced that there's changes coming to the financial system. And this whole thing that's going on right now, the whole world crisis, is to put these in place. You never let a good war or pandemic go to waste. Or they don't. They don't let a good pandemic go to waste. Underground ain't on the up, I'm back. Did you research Constellation? I used to own some Constellation. Using the DAG. But Constellation is it's, it's good. It's good. I haven't, I haven't went deep on it either. Um... news of jp coin so where like is this real news though or did it or is this a tiktok thing or was there actual new news that came out about jpm coin <clears throat> okay it looks like three weeks ago there was some um yeah three weeks ago was the last oh okay goldman sachs taps jp morgan's private blockchain um so did somebody, I think this was just a TikTok thing that really spun up. And now the XRP people are having to defend XRP from, from this JPM coin. Um, get ready for Binance to close in BC. I hope they don't, man. I hope they don't. Binance is my main exchange. My main exchange is Binance. Is there actually such a thing as bull run, bear run? Yeah. <clears throat> bull market and bear market are, are things, yes.
there is no mining in XRP. Isn't that a problem? Hell no. That makes it better. <clears throat> that makes it better. So nobody's like wanting higher fees and stuff so that they can mine it. There's no hash rate centralization. Um, will that a matter? You seen Blockchain Boy's response to me? He did? <clears throat> Let me see. Hold on. Another one or are you... see this oh my he did should I watch it right now I'm about to watch it bro is there there a device in your room they're trying to brainwash you what what are you talking about okay I'm watching this ready live reaction folks Live reaction. I'm about to watch this dude. He looks like he's in a car. Hold on. Let me uh, do this. What's in my cup? That's water over there. Ready? I'm watching it. Oh, he took it personal. Okay, I paused it. Hold on, we got... Hello? Hello. One question. Do you invest in cryptocurrency? Oh my god, I think I went live with you before, and if I say no, you're gonna get mad. Yeah, I'm gonna kick you off. Bye. Okay, let me keep watching this. Why, why are y'all watching me if you don't invest in crypto? I guess you're trying to learn, though. I guess you're trying to learn. Okay, I'm still watching this. It looks like Blockchain Boy took it personally. Okay, so Okay, so basically I got nothing out of that. So basically I got nothing out of Blockchain Boys video right there. Uh yes, yeah, this, this is MJ on the shirt. Um So he took it personally it looks like. Yo, what's your name again? Crypto, I forget the name, but yo, you hit him. You hit him personally, dude. <laughs> but um dude it's just like like it's so obvious what's going on it's so obvious what's going on with that uh yeah it's so obvious bro so even if like jpm coin so i like how he admitted that jpm coin is not gonna replace xrp but i feel like at the end of his video he's literally said that um but comparing JPM coin to XRP is absolutely stupid. It is completely stupid. Oh, yeah. Okay, there it is. Crypto Leo Limited. Oh, shit. He's got the limited going on. Yeah, you hit him. You hit him. Um, you know when he starts with... Yeah, you took. he took it to heart. Go live on Twitch. Maybe later today I'll go live on Twitch. Um, but do JPM coin, man, like... Like, you think they're going to name it JPM Coin? What even is that? It feels like the biggest distraction ever. It feels like the biggest distraction ever. So then you're telling me all of the other central banks... All of the other central banks are going to just... Make, another, make a coin of their own? Why wouldn't they just use something that's... You know, a, a private ledger, Ripple CBDC private ledger. And and this whole thing with like 
combining the idea of CBDCs with them being crypto. Like what? Um, I need to watch that video again, actually, dude. Because I feel like he did make one point in there. They want control. Um... I think damn near everything will run on XRP Ledger. Dude, we're gonna have to see. I hate how they have it in limbo. I would be so much more confident right now. I would be going crazy on XRP if they weren't in this lawsuit because I do see both sides of it, dude. I do see both sides of it. It could easily turn into a... Uh... If you spam that once more, okay, boom, you're getting muted, bro. Uh, contact me on Instagram if you want to get unmuted. Uh, if you're worried about exchange going down, just use a VPN. I don't... I don't advise using VPNs on anything. I don't advise anything, first of all. But I don't like using VPNs. That's kind of... I don't know. Just find a location, find an exchange in your area. Um... Uh, Will JPM token replace XRP? No. No. It will not. I still need to research hard on JPM coin though because this feels like the biggest just distraction ever. Like ever. Like his ugly name, coin. I don't think they would even call their stuff a coin. Like not publicly investable jpm coin is a stable coin pegged one to one to the u.s dollar why do they call xrp a cult and why call it a shit coin the facts are there well because xrp actually is a cult the the, the ring of people that are like xrp maxis it's it's kind of a look looked at as a cult from the outside uh ripple separated themselves from xrp if we enter bear market xrp will not recover okay but what if um it gets real world usage and we start um we start going utility run what if we have a utility run we had a shit coin season i agree with blockchain boy on that we had a shit coin season we didn't have an altcoin season um cult or passionate exactly cult or passionate and anyone who's actually went deep on xrp you know how obvious it is dude you know how obvious it is you see brad garlinghouse on the world economic forum sitting right there you see him sitting across like hong kong monetary authority all this stuff you see um all the partnerships national bank of egypt they signed 15 partnerships while being sued. We had Rosie Rose, or whatever her name is, come onto the team while in a lawsuit. We see the judge favoring, um, we see the judge favoring Ripple in every damn freaking thing. <clears throat> Cryptolio, I, I'm not trying to do no du dual lives right now, but definitely we got to set that up. We definitely got to set that up. Anybody in here that hasn't, go watch Mason's Decodes. Yes. Go watch them. Go watch them. Um, now, only if you have an open mind, because that's back when I was really going crazy with what I actually know. Uh, Sakura Inu. XYO, good use cases. Just go to their website, dude. Go to their website. They have a thing called use cases right here. They have plenty and they're really, really good. They're really, really good. Um, where is it? Um, implementation. Case studies. Scroll down. Here you go. Airports, e-commerce, national security, drones. Rental cars, insurance, hospitals. 
go read the blurbs. They've got some blurbs right here and you can click this and it'll bring you to literally a use case with a problem solution, how it works and a bunch of other stuff. So very easy to find the XYO use cases. Explain why you, why you will be selling most of your shares when XRP hits $10. So first of all, they're not shares. Um, don't call them that because <laughs> you would be contributing to the SEC by doing that. You would actually be contributing to it being deemed a security. Um, but why am I selling? I'm only selling 20 to 40% just because I'm kind of done with... Uh, I've been holding XRP since 2017. I only held like 500 bucks in 2017 because I was a broke 17 year old. Um, so <laughs> I got to watch that go to all time high though. It was like $5 Canadian that I went to. Um, no, I would never say shares. I would never ever say shares. I would say I'm selling my XRP. I'd, I'd say I'm selling 20 to 40% of my XRP. Uh, XRP is a crypto security, simple as that. Exactly, a security token. It's the missing link is security token. All of my shit that's on my YouTube will be proven and I'm gonna, I'm going to do I told you so videos. Or, or I'm going to do prediction videos on all of it. But it does not make sense to make XRP a traditional security. Zero cents. Zero cents. And hold on. Coin market cap screenshot from 2014. Hold on. Okay, I want to show you guys something. The main problem that nobody has brought up. I do not know why nobody has brought this up with the XRP lawsuit. I don't know why. It's the most obvious thing ever. Look at this. This is what... This is what Ripple used to look like on the charts. You got to listen closely here. It used to be like this. See? They had the Ripple logo. This is from July 10, 2016. They had the Ripple logo, not the XRP logo. They had the name as Ripple, not XRP. But they did have the ticker as XRP, the symbol. Notice... If a noob clicked on this, they would be buying into Ripple, which could be considered a security, right? Because they might think that they're buying Ripple shares, but really they're buying this, okay? And then they, they I don't know when they did it, but when I came back to crypto, there was a new XRP logo, and this was called XRP like how it is now. Right? Because now it's like this, how it should have been at the start. But they really screwed up by putting the Ripple logo here. It should have been XRP, XRP the whole time. This is the main problem. And I don't know why that hasn't brought, been brought up in the lawsuit. Why did you list this stuff? Why did you initially list that as Ripple? Why? Why did they initially do that? It feels like some kind of head fake or manipulation to where, like, they almost trick the public into thinking they're buying Ripple. Because if I was allowed to invest in Ripple, the company, at the beginning, I would have. If I, if I was allowed right now, I would have. I would, too. Um, Binance outside USA. Yo, nobody panic about the Binance thing. 
Don't panic about the Binance thing. Don't panic about the USDT thing. None of it. If action is needed to be taken, I'm definitely um, going to tell you guys. Chainlink and Swift partnership. I've never seen that. I've never seen that. Panic if you're in Ontario? Nope, still don't. Because you have till December 31. December 31, dude. Um, dude, I can't believe somebody requested the live. It was the same person that requested the live before, too. Worst case is XRP receives a fine. They could receive a fine and just keep it keep it pushing. Howie test will be replaced with Ripple test. Yeah, this Howie test thing, I'm not too brushed up on that. Um, Mason, how old are you? I'm 20. What's happening with Flare Snapshot? I have no idea, dude. That whole thing is a mess and I'm tired of these messy, messy things with XRP. Um, What's my opinion on Jed McCaleb selling off 240 million? He's been doing that for months, dude. He's been doing that for months. You can check his balance with this. Um, you can actually check his balance. I'll show you with this uh, site. See, this is the Jed balance. Ruby, I see you. I see you, Ruby. Uh, this is the Jed balance, look. As you can see, consistently he's selling off. If he continues, if Jed continues to sell at his one week average, he will run out in 167 days. If he continues on his one month average, he runs out in 97 days. If he continues on 83 or on three months, he runs out in 83. So you can literally check his balance. It's all public and you could watch him dump if you want to. You can watch him dump if you want to. Um, so when he runs out, I guess that's going to have an effect. It's not going to be suppressed anymore, the, the price. Um, what's the big change in your XRP position? There is none. Dude, people are so delusional on this app, man. They're so delusional on this app. They see me just being real about XRP and their whole illusion is shattered. People have you brainwashed. People have you brainwashed, okay? These crypto influencers, some of them have you brainwashed. <laughs> you need to break out of it. If you're watching XRP content every day, just echo chambering, you need to break out of it. There are hard questions that we can't even answer with XRP. There are legitimately hard questions that we can't answer with XRP. We just get stumped. <clears throat> now, whether that be lack of research on our part, but some of these need to be asked. Why wouldn't they just make their own thing? Why wouldn't they? Okay, then that falls back on why did they sign up? 100 plus bank partnerships, why? If they're not going to use it, why? Is that just going to fall over? Oh, is that just, they're just going to fade away those partnerships? They would have been fading away already. XRP has been sued or Ripple has been sued for seven months. Um, seven months. Ruby, send me a message on Instagram. By the way, my Instagram messages are open, folks. You can you can message me on there. I closed my TikTok because it would just get too much spam. Too much spam. Like this dude, Gurjinder. Look at this dude, Gurjinder, spamming. Can crypto go down more? Of course it can. 
Crypto goes up and down, folks. Crypto goes up and down. Um, price prediction for VeChain? Don't have one. I don't care. <laughs> don't care. 50 cents. Let's go to 50 cents. I would love that. Uh, Rick Raheem, yep. I watched Rick Raheem. <clears throat> Apparently he has some shady stuff on Google about him. I've looked into it, but I can't really see what, what's up with that. It doesn't look like he's doing anything weird. When I first heard of crypto, what was my first thought? Well, it was, I heard of Bitcoin and I thought it was dope. I thought it was like, uh, I didn't understand it really. But now I know what's up with it. Now I know. Um, you trust Rick Raheem bot? I don't know. Yo, harsh, I can't talk about that, dude. Um, you had some shit posts at the beginning. Yes, I definitely did. I can't wait until those are those are running up out of context. Yay, I can't wait to be taken out of context. All my tweets too, I can't wait until they take me out of context uh, when something happens. Can't wait. They're probably gonna AI me too. They're gonna make an AI of me and say I said something. They'll do it to you too. Um, do we need to worry about Binance? No, don't worry about Binance. If something really is happening with Binance, we'll know. We will know. Uh, Coach JV, hell yeah. Definitely watch him. One bad llama, dude. I'm not getting trolled by that, dude. I ain't getting trolled by that, dude. Um, Picklick and uh, WebDev Geo. Appreciate it. Who's my favorite entrepreneur? That's hard. I don't even know. What do you think of Wealth Simple? I heard they added some new coins on there. Which that could actually have a price, a little price bounce because. Yeah, I like that question. You think we're in a bear market or is this healthy? I think this is healthy. Um, but yeah, the Wealth Simple thing could actually, like, they do so much marketing. They do so much marketing. I'm concerned with CoinX. Yeah, CoinX, all the volume on. A lot of the CoinX volume is uh, bots. Damn, 58 year old. I saw that. That's amazing. Love that vid between you and BCB. One of the best lives ever. Oh yeah, we're gonna do it again. We're going to do it again. His middle name is Mason. Did you guys see that part of it? You guys can watch me and Blockchain Boys live back. If anybody wants to watch that back. Did anybody, was anybody there for the Blockchain Boy uh, dual live stream? The co-live stream? Was anybody in there? Spam up a yes. Spam up a yes if you were in there when I was live with Blockchain Boy. I'm going to go live with Pablo too soon. Um, I'm going to talk to him about XRP and I'm actually probably going to ask him a couple. I got some theories on that, dude. Uh, do you promote coins? Last per last paid promotion I did was a month ago, folks. More than a month ago now. Um, last paid promo was a month ago, dude. Okay, hold on. You guys can watch this back. Uh, oh, I put that on my main channel, didn't I? Yeah, it's on my main channel. That's cool. <laughs> um, do you think Trust Wallet will be affected by Ontario Binance News? No. ETH will bounce up. I, I do think we're going to bounce up. Tomorrow we'll be back in the green, I think. We're just continuously bouncing between 30 to 40K. 
It's what I've been saying for uh, two weeks. Pablo was talking about how I got banned. What did he say? What did Pablo say about about um, me getting banned? Um. These bots have to leave. Dude, it's getting so bad, man. It's getting so bad. He was trying to live with you, but he couldn't. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we were supposed to. Really good TikTok. When you answered, oh yeah. Yeah, I think my response was, I think my response was good, right? Cause it's just a coin for like, it's nothing. It doesn't mean XRP is not special. <laughs> Nobody's favorite, dude. Um, okay, yeah, let me show you the live. Where is it? Where's that live? Sundays are usually bad for crypto, yeah. If you guys weren't there for the Blockchain Boy live stream, it's right here. Hour 16. Hour 16. Look at this. Let's click on it. Look at that. Helium, helium is a big, big check mark. Huge check mark for me. Huge check mark for me. You gotta watch Peter Thiel, folks. I'm gonna keep telling you, they'll probably boot me off for this, but they'll probably boot me off for this, but Elon Musk is a distraction for Peter Thiel, okay? Listen again, Elon Musk, did he get you with any pranks? Yeah, he did. He did, hold on, let me show you one second. Look, you can even skip to where I got pranked, I think. Just go here. Yeah, look at this, Crypto Mason gets trolled. You can skip to here and watch me get trolled by him. Look at his little face. Look at his little face, he knows he's about to troll me. Look at my face, look at his little face. He's about to troll me. Look at this dude, he knows he's about to troll me. Um, damn, what was I talking about? Somebody remind me what I was talking about before that. Um. Oh yeah, P uh, Elon Musk is a distraction for what Peter Thiel is doing. You need to watch Peter Thiel. You need to watch Peter Thiel. And he's involved in Helium, I believe. And watch his old, watch Peter Thiel's old interviews about crypto and China. Northwest flying, I see you. Some of y'all have some very recognizable profile pictures. I dare one of you to put your profile picture as me. And then when you come in here, I'll always see your comment because it'll be funny. Can you send link on Peter Thiel? I have, you can join the free Telegram update channel. Right there, Gold Squad. This is how you join the Gold Squad and start to become part. I put some updates in here. Also, you can go right here. Look at all these beautiful graphs for you to look at. So much resources. Here's the VeChain ecosystem. Um, here we've got countries that don't tax Bitcoin. We've got the, this is probably the most valuable one, the Singapore blockchain landscape. You can look through this. As you can see, Engine is on there. 
You can look through that and see what coins are being used in Singapore. We can see the original ISO 2022 chart. All of that is in the Gold Squad Telegram. There's the link, it's also in my bio. That's free to join, you just join up and get updates. You'll get updated whenever I go live as well. And when some new videos come up. Uh, that last chart, hell yeah. Damn, it's so hot where I'm at, it's 37. This is what my thing is saying. 37 Celsius. Is that even real? My thing is saying 37 Celsius. Dude, that's insane. One time I'm gonna do an outdoor live. I'm just gonna be walking or in a park or something. Cause it's, it's like... Dubai is boiling at 45. INX when? July. July. Australia, damn. What up, Alan? Do you racism? What are you saying? Uh, so you still hold XRP? Yes. When did I say that I sold my XRB. You ever talk to Crypto Weather? Yes. Do you watch George? Yep. Need more outdoor rant videos? Those are like spur of the moment. I can't fake those, folks. I just, I can't fake those, man. Like I can't just go out, I can't just go on a walk and, and um, like there has to be something on my mind. Thoughts on blockchain boys, XRP hate. I don't care. I do not care if anyone hates on XRP. Um, we're going, for me, I will be holding XRP till zero or the moon. That's how it is. And I can do that only because um, I'm not trying to immediately make money off this. He's in a contract to dump his XRP. He's not dumping because he doesn't believe in XRP. Um, he's in a contract to dump it. And he's going to run out. Crypto Weatherman, thanks for the finger heart, bro. Um, he's going to run out in probably around 150 to 80 days. If we're, if we're looking at the... The average right here. Once again, if he dumps on his one week average continuously, he will run out this year still at the end of this year. If he dumps on his one month average, he's going to run out in 97 days, three month average, 83 days. Here's the recent uh, releases for him. And we can see it's going down. So, and it's continuously going down. So I, I'm not sure when that runs out, I'm not sure how big of an impact that's having on the price. I don't know. Um, but we'll see. That's one of the things like that's suppressing the price, I guess. When's my live with Pablo going to be? On his next one, I'll be on it most likely. I was supposed to go on on there um, and talk to him. Was it yesterday? I think it was. Uh, 
Britcoin? What is that? I remember hearing this, but is this like a um, stable coin? I think it is. Ethereum Classic's a no for me, dude. I'd rather just have Ethereum. Bitcoin was a con, wasn't it? I don't think it's a con. I think it's just like not what it's supposed to be right now. It's been like transformed into something. It's like not even the initial intent. Heard of X coin and Grime X? No. Nah. What chair is this? Dude, I don't, I got this as a gift. I don't know where it's from. Doesn't even have a name on it. Um, so I don't know. I'm sorry. All gaming type chairs look like this. H bar limit order set them at 20 cents. Dude, if I had a limit order on Quant at $28. Quant has been so volatile. Cello. Yeah, now Cello has traded places. Cello is now 41% up. Um, all right, I'm going to hop off here, though, folks. Thank you all for watching. Make sure you follow on Instagram, Twitter. Um, check the link in my bio. And stay tuned for more uh, more vids, folks. I'm not stopping. You think I'm stopping? What the hell? What the hell? I'm going to keep going. They can't stop me. They suspended me from live for nothing. Oh, yeah. Potential Twitch live stream. It's super hot where I'm at. So maybe... Like, you guys don't understand how much... How draining live streaming really is. Especially tri Twitch stream. But, um... Yeah, I'm not stopping, dude. They can do whatever. They can give me community guideline violations for nothing. They can um, ban me on YouTube Live. They can do whatever. I don't even care. I'm going to keep going. Um, next giveaway. We did run a, a giveaway for... It was 500 USDT and a bunch of lifetime Discord uh, memberships. Inside the Discord, we did Ooh, Instagram Live. Hmm, maybe. Or maybe I'll just do another TikTok Live later and then go on to Instagram after like we always do. But peace out, folks. I love you all and goodbye.